you're 21, you drop out of college, and you move to New York to pursue a career in music, yeah. which is really risky. Were you worried at all? What gave me the balls to go to New York and, and chase it? Here's what, here's what happened. I'm sitting in some bar playing music, and these people, this nice couple, Tammy and John Pratt, came up to me and they said, uh, would you be interested in doing any acting? So I thought, man, I'm going to suck at music because already they're telling me to do something else, right? But I said, sure. They uh, set me up with some acting agent in New York. Anyway, nothing was happening for me. No surprise. <laughs> and I came home and I was there, you know, listening to these records, learning them, sitting home at the house, writing songs. I made a recording and uh, they liked the songs. So a guy named Kenny Gorka gave me a gig at the Bitter End in New York City wow. in 1997. After the show, they said to come down and let's have a meeting and they offered me this deal. I turned the deal down. What, why is that? The guy was saying, hey, you're the next Paul Simon. I said, but this doesn't read like I'm the next Paul Simon. So, you know, the contract will read how you really feel about me, you know? 